Hey, what's up, everybody? Hey! Here's Melissa. She did her hair. She's really excited. She always says that she looks like a train wreck in our videos. And now look at how, how beautiful she is. Yeah, hair down. No big deal. So we're gonna go uh, feed our goat friends, go skateboard in, and then we'll see what happens after that. Yeah, so we have like skateboarding and goat feeding all going on at once. This is the this classic Greek stuff. And I just went forward a little bit, and then just went. Alright, just take this in your hand. We got an apple core. Before I get out of the road. for the vlog but it's I'm, fun for me i think it's really fun that we have goats right across the street from our house and, and feed them they take food right from our house Corey, no. Corey. hey what's up everybody welcome to this week's edition of greek stuff we are in the bed together above the covers this is a g-rated video but right above the bed is a light switch perfect greek stuff where are we going no it would be an abandoned be hotel that's really really old i don't remember how old you think it's haunted? No, but I do think there's secret passageways. Mommy, the car ran that bird over. Beware of the attacking piano. According to the internet, this hotel was built in the early 1900s, and it was during the Ottoman reign of the of this island, which would be like Turkish. You can kind of see like the Turkish architecture, and it was the it was the nicest hotel in all of Greece. And now, it sounds like it's super haunted. What was that banging noise, guys? I don't know. But there's a hole right here. Probably just the wind blowing something. I think this might have been the main room. Why? Right here. And here comes the riot police. Today we're and going 300 meters turn right. 200, 300 meters turn right. Got 200. it. 200 meters. Okay. So we're having, we're going to this like secret cove beach thing that we found that we heard is really good for snorkeling, but we heard the road is really rough. So we are taking our friend's car, taking their car off-roading because they're on vacation. <laughs> Thanks Tanner and Katie for letting us use your off-road vehicle.
thing about filming these vlogs is you film stuff and you don't want like someone to fall or get hurt, <laughs> but you know it's gonna be really funny if they do. Where do the refugee boats come from? Turkey's right over there. They come to all the way from Turkey to Moria. That's why we're here to help refugees. Sitting on this beach is super nice. Except and for the dead goat. Except for the dead goat. But it's really nice to be out uh, exploring and just enjoying this day. But as we look on the beach all around us, these wrecked boats that refugees used to come over from Turkey to here. And it's um, just like a, a reminder everywhere of why we're here. And what brought us to this island is to help others. And um, we enjoy this time of being in creation and exploring. But at the same time, we're remorseful to um, what's going on around us and we just Pray for those people and continue to try to help how we can. I'm just letting him get some water. Good job, buddy. You can keep it as a pet, but except you're gonna need like a water tank. When I looked behind me and I saw a trail of ink, so then I went. So then I saw a squid. I went, grabbed it, swam back to mommy when she had the GoPro. Then it slipped out of my hands. And I found it again, caught it, caught it again. This time, and this time, I was holding it with one hand too. And I actually looked it out of the water. Mommy was, well, as mommy was taking the video. And it was really cool because it was crawling around in my hand. 